The Sydney Roosters have survived a rugby league roller coaster to pick up a crucial two competition points. A good crowd turned up for an important and mouth-watering Monday night fixture at Suncorp Stadium. The Roosters entered the clash as underdogs, largely due to the emissions of their star halfback Mitchell Pearce and gun second rower Nate Miles. But for informed back rowers, it was hard to look past this fellow. And as far as the damage went, his hooker Andrew McCulloch became the main beneficiary. The Roosters appeared to have an early reply, but the video ref pinning Anthony Minicello for a double movement. Their opener came soon after, however. Todd Carney's effort, a beauty. He was at it again, laying on a gem for the hard-running Kenny Dow, and then it became the razzle-dazzle Roosters. Their third try in the space of 10 minutes, affording the Tricolours a 16 points to 6 lead at half time. Play had just resumed for the second half before BJ Leilua found his way onto the scorer's sheet. And with the Broncos looking ominous, a forced error would see Sean Kenny Dowell hightailing it off to a treble. Matt Gillette gave the locals some hope. Israel Folau had them thinking maybe. There's no stopping, is he? And then Antonio Winterstein's four-pointer signalled game on. He'll score! The Broncos' whirlwind continued and the lead was theirs, but not without controversy. And then I said, oh, I want to see oh, him yeah, the boy, 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 that, that is terrible. Is terrible. With the Roosters well and truly up against the ropes, something very special would be required. The Broncos would have a right of reply, but all to no avail. The Sydney Roosters winning in dramatic circumstances. The 34-30 victory making it four wins on the trot. Joel Kane, Big Pond Sport.